Hi, I'm Midge. Hi, and I'm Madge. And this is another Midge and Madge Mingle. Now, we, we apologize because we were just live for like five minutes and realized our iPad said we were live. Right. It said we were on, but we were not on, so we don't know what happened. So we did a little reboot, and we are back. And look, we're here. <gasps> Yay, we're so, here this time. Yes. Good, because I was getting a little nervous that we were going to have a problem all day. Right. We, we got it fixed. We fixed it. Yep. Fixed it, baby. Fixed it. Fixed and done. So, yeah. hey everyone. Welcome to a new week. Yes, and we're so <laughs> excited. We are. Well, we're excited every Monday. We're just always excited. Well, what, you know what? We go to CHA Thursday. Woohoo! It's yes, going to be quite the experience flying with me on the airplane this time. She gets be... to bring her jazzy. I do. I do. I actually rode it over to her house she on did. Saturday. And she honked the cute little horn. Beep, beep. And I said, excuse me, where are the pegs on back for me to stand? Hi, Allie Kapler. Hey, Al. Yeah, where are the pegs? So, um, Jake, please get on the peg situation yeah. because I need to ride too. The peg or the bar on back, like the yes. little platform, like yes. Nicole we're talking about? Yes, that would be fine too. That would be awesome socks. All right. So, again, mm -hmm. we apologize. Awesome socks. You did. Awesome, awesome socks. socks. I love it. Okay. I, I just... It was awesome. Whatever awesome thing you want to name is okay. great. I, I love that. <laughs> but we thought we were live. We weren't. But now we are here. We are. Okay. And boy, do we have something fun for you. We do. We are doing Dollar Spot statement pieces. Now, by that, we don't mean like your regular statement piece, like you walk in somewhere and it's this big eye-catching. Yes. Not that. Not the angels are singing. <laughs> we actually mean a statement, like a statement that you love. Yes. And make something with that statement. Correct. So, Correct. and you know, I will say we actually, we were inspired to make this because we saw something similar, um, but it was so much more money. A lot more money. And it was like one of those, oh. And then we went to the dollar spot, which was our next store. And of we course. saw all these items in the dollar spot. That we could make our own. Our own. To say exactly what we want. Yeah. On the cheap. Hey! Laura Neiman's here. Hey, Laura. We're going to see her in a few days. We are, and we're <laughs> excited. We are. So, yeah. So, you guys, this is a very simple, easy project that you only need to have just maybe a couple supplies, mm -hmm. and it's perfect for anywhere in the home. Kids' bedroom, a bathroom, your craft room, anywhere. Really? Yes. Everywhere. Kitchen. Anywhere. You could have one in every room. You could. You could, and it wouldn't cost hardly anything. It wouldn't. And it would be a fun craft for the kids also. Yeah, to make something that is important to them, or even just their name. If they want to do their name, that would be fun, too. Hey, you know what? That would be yep. M-A-D-G-E, Madge. <laughs> Madge can spell. <laughs> We're so happy. We are. Hey, Donna's here. Hey, Donna. Hi, Donna. We're super stoked because, Donna, in case you missed it, we have something fun for you today. Dollar Spot Statements Pieces. Dollar Spot Statement Pieces. Say that, Say that. five times <laughs> Because I just messed it up with one time. Yep. Me too. Okay. Go ahead. So, <laughs> Tell us okay, what we need. Let's, what, what you need is, okay, you could do a shadow box yes. of any shape. Like, we found this cute octagon. We would just take this little thing out. This was at the dollar spot. It was. Um, or the, the ones that we are using, you can see I let the price tag on the little $3 dollar spot. Yes. Tag. Yes, from Target. These were just little, uh, what did they say? Something like, this is my happy place this or something about... Mm -hmm happiness but they were really bright primary colors mm -hmm. and it was just flat so it was a shadow box and then just flat words on the inside on the inside but we chose to make them different we did. so you need some paint in whatever color you want to use deco art is what we deco use art. we, we love both deco use deco art paint, paint. Um, you need some paper if you want to line your box, and we both use die cuts with a view papers yes love die cuts and now I have forgotten the name I used but it was something with gold it was the real, it had gold, a lot of gold foil pieces and crap. I'm sorry, but we love die cuts with a view paper. Too. We do. Mine is vintage, something also. <laughs> I'm sorry. We're not doing good today. We aren't. Okay. We, we'll type in the comments. How about this? In the comments below the video, you will see a comment from Midge and Madge, and we will actually share with you the stack, the paper stack from die cuts. Yes. That we used. Okay. How's that? That's great. Because I left mine home. So you need some deco art paint. You need some die cuts with a view paper. You need some Beacon Power Tack and like some three in one or the mixed media glue, mm -hmm. whatever you want to use. Yes. I'm just laughing because oh no. Laura gave us a shout out and she said, Watch my girls Midge and Madge making some cute shit live right now. 
I love that. We love so that. She meant to post it on her <laughs> wall, but she put it in a comment. But thanks so much for the shout out. Thank you. Yes. Um, that's awesome. Um, we used some like doilies or some prima flowers, the things that you like, embellishments that you love, yes. maybe some um, charms yes. or metal pieces. Mm -hmm. Correct. And then, really importantly, you need some alphabet blocks. And we got these alphabet blocks, of course, at the dollar spot. Yes. Um, really simple, really cheap. So basically for our projects, we spent, was this $3? It was $3. We spent $3 on the shadow box or frame, and Correct. we spent $3 on a box of blocks. Correct. And I was able to use only one box of blocks and one shadow box. So that yes. was $6, friends. $6. Yes. And then the supplies that you have on hand. Correct. The paint, the glue, the paper. Yes. Yada, yada. Okay. Yes. So what we did very first is, did you, did you use this on yours? I didn't. So. I didn't. But that would have been smart because I had to do several coats of paint, but that would have been a smart thing to do. I used a coat of gesso. Mm -hmm. Am I saying it right? You are. I gesso. always question myself with that gesso um, um, because I wanted to, because they were bright primary colors. So I just like wanted to make sure that they wouldn't bright, bright blue. pop through because this gold was kind of, it's not super dark. So, mm -hmm. And then after the gesso, I used my deco art and it was the americana the metallic glorious gold was the one that glorious i used glorious 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 gold just had to say oh that. wow for a second i thought she was going into a verse of gloria but she didn't I she didn't. whipped out a new song I right did. there for everyone for everyone for everyone <laughs> hey janine okay. hello hello so there. we're excited for you to join us today okay and then madge i've noticed has done her she painted her entire block I did not because I kind of wanted the wood in the picture to show through a little bit super so you could cute. see what it was because we all know I'm not super serious. So, <laughs> so I gessoed the entire alphabet block. Yes. I gessoed my frame. Mm -hmm. Then I painted gold around the frame, yes. of course. And I used my trusty friends, the Q-tips, to paint... <laughs> the Q-tips. The Q-tips. To paint the letters because I'm not really good. I can't control the brush very good. There's a story laughing, so. behind the Q-tips. It's a secret story, but I laugh every time. She teases me about Q-tips no matter what. It's okay. Nobody's even even mad. It's actually a happy thought. I'm for sure me. she's dying to tell you. She's <laughs> gonna tell you soon. I know it. Okay, so and I just I just dipped the Q-tip in the gold paint and just carefully outlined because you can see I just did the outline and the letter. Yes, and then everything else was. Just gesso, or I did do a quick coat of white paint just across the front of the block, but that okay. was it. Okay. I let I just left the gesso on the side so you could see the wood and all that business. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess we could show show one of these. show our blocks because our blocks are a little bit different than like the vintage wood blocks that mm -hmm. that you have. They have a letter on both sides, but then they have these little like black pictures stamped on all the other sides. I don't even know if you can see what I'm doing here. But hi, Debbie, and thanks so hi, much Debbie. for the comment. Love, love, love these guys. Oh, thank you. Donna said, do tell. So, <laughs> I know, she's dying. Okay, so Q-tip to paint the letters and the outside. And then, honestly, I cut my, I flipped. <laughs> I, I couldn't think of the best way to trace to get the right size. Uh -huh. Heaven forbid I measure and just cut it. I mean, so, I mean, uh, there are these things. <laughs> it right was here. really late when I made this. It's called a ruler. I thought about that after the fact. So I, okay. before I painted my box, uh -huh. I know you're going to laugh so hard right now. I inked. <laughs> The inside edge of my shadow box right here I inked and then I flipped it upside down on my paper and hurried and like stamped my box down and that made the perfect size for me to cut out and glue you on the what, inside. Though? You know what? That's thinking right there. That is thinking outside. I made it harder than it needed to be. Yes. But, but that's you know, what you, I did. You did it. So, Let's see. Sorry, real quick. Good. Michelle said hello. Hi, and Wendy, Wendy says Hello, ladies. Hey, Wendy. Okay, so that was it. You're killing me I right love now. it. When you did the stamp thing, that's fabulous. So I painted. I okay. put the piece of paper in that I cut out. Mm -hmm. I used the Q-tips to paint the letters. I love that so much. And then I used my, please do it. Okay. Power tack. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. She didn't. Shh. There we go. There's the whippet. The power of power tack yes. to glue my blocks down where I wanted them. And then I embellished with a little doily and a flower. I'm not done. I had a crown, but I lost it. I'm putting it somewhere and some other things. But So this is me. It's kind of elegant, but the saying is not at all. So, I love it. So, you know, it's kind of... It's kind of me. When I saw your saying, I thought, you know, that is so Midge. I, I absolutely <laughs> love it. 
So I am trust your gut. There trust you go. Trust your gut. And that was me. Mm -hmm. Now, do you want me to tell this idea? Yes. Or you want to do yours? Go ahead. Go okay. ahead and say that I idea. had another idea because I'm probably going to make another one. Um, instead of putting the paper back here, either use a piece of felt mm -hmm. or a giant Velcro strip, but felt would be much easier. And then the dollar store has these already done little squares of Velcro. Mm -hmm. And you could just put a piece of Velcro on the back of your blocks and change out your saying. Yes. So See, if you fun. wanted to do that. If you or wanted to make it like a holiday box, you know, I know that they always have those, the holiday things where you can interchange different mm -hmm. things. You could do it like that, but it doesn't even have to be holiday. Like Mitch said, it can be. Or you could turn it into a kid craft and they could practice like their spelling and stuff. What? I just pulled that right out. All you school teachers, take notes. <laughs> but there you go. We love that. that. Right. All right. I love it. Now show me yours because, of course, you went above and beyond. Well, let me read the comments. Oh, okay. You have, Jake says, nice. Thanks, Thanks Jake. Thanks, hun. <laughs> Christine says, very cute. Julia, very cute. Laura, love. Janine, love it. Laura, elegant with not elegant words is my style too, girl. <laughs> I love it. Awesome. Okay, so for my box, I um, I used a couple, well, I used a lot of different paint. Yeah. I first painted it this bright, this bright pink color right here, and my microphone's right here, here so I'm just going to hold it. the power tack on the microphone? Yes, let's do that. So it doesn't, it floats away sometimes. Um, this one is dragon fruit. So I painted my whole box dragon fruit, and I was... I was loving it, but it took a couple a couple coats that because sounds so exotic. Dragon <laughs> fruit. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, um, sorry, go. <laughs> and I'm a little bit of a spaz because it was driving me crazy to have the inside sides of my box like streaky. I couldn't get them nice and a nice clean paint. So I decided to cut my paper and put my paper on the inside here. And then once I did that, I thought. I can't just have it be a plain color. So I added in um, the um, Deco Art. Let's see what color is this? Waterfront. waterfront. Deco Art Waterfront. That's one of my favorites. I also added in the, the metallic. Mm -hmm. This is Glorious Gold also. <gasps> we must just have different bottles. Yep. <laughs> and then I also added in um, this Glamour Ooh, Dust, yes. which is Gold Glitz, just to put everywhere. But then I had an idea. I wanted to make it more vintagey, um, and so I used um, this little ink, cat eye ink box, and this color is stucco. So it's like a really dark brown color. With a hint of reddish, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I ended up using that, and then for my blocks, I took the block. I'll show you my box. I took my... <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you my home decor. Shadow box. I'm reaching right here because I can only imagine right now. So okay. Me. All right. <laughs> so these are my blocks here. I painted all around the outside solid gold. And then I painted everything pink. And then I went back through with a small paintbrush. And I painted around the outside of the letter and the actual letter um, in this waterfront color. And it was they were they were really, really cute. But I still needed that more vintage vibe. It was too cute for you. It was. It was too cute for me. I had to add in that stucco um, just to give up so they weren't so like bam at me. And say, Hi Chris. Hi Chris. So that's what I did with my blocks and then as you can see <laughs> I lined. Donna says no comment. No comment. Laura says this show just lost its G rating. <laughs> That's where I was going with that, Laura. I was struggling for just a minute. Struggling. I composed myself. So many things. <laughs> um, and so I used um, the Fast Finish Decoupage. Oh, I forgot. That's what I used to put the paper on my box, too. Sorry. There yes, you go. Yes, it's okay. Um, decoupage. And it is amazing. It dries very quickly. And I absolutely love it. And then I used the Power of Power Tack. Do, do, do. Boo. -do. Yep. I use the power of power tack for my letters and and putting um, my flowers down. My doily, I actually use the decoupage, but then um, my flowers and my key, I actually used power tack. Yes, ma'am. So that's what I did. How about those apples? <laughs> Step one, cut a hole. I love that so much. Okay. Janine says, love the oh, color combo. Thank yes. you. Thank you. 
I actually love how it turned out. Um, I do. We I really do. didn't know what we were going to get when we had the... We did that a lot. We get a really good idea, and we're not always sure how it's going to work out. But this was awesome. And I do have to say, you guys, it's one of those things... I know a lot of people think that we craft together all the time. Like, in together. Mm -hmm. But a lot of the time, we don't. A lot of the time, we are calling or FaceTiming or whatever, but we're in our own craft spaces. So it's always a surprise to each of us when we see our projects. When I show up in the morning and surprise. Mm -hmm. Like today. Yeah. Again, we apologize. We, you know, when three quarters of your closet is a doornut, you're going to end up yep. wearing some of the same styles. Yes. yes. And again, we have done it not on purpose, but we right. matchy matchy. So yeah. hey, you know, what? at least we're color coordinated. That is true. You know what? That's good. I mean, we could have different colors on. And that would maybe make people's eyes googly. It would. But no, we blend. We blend we really do. well today. We do. In our adornment wear. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, so what are your thoughts about um, these cute shadow boxes? Wendy said fun ideas. Okay. We love that so much. If you were to make one, here's a question for you. Oh. If you were to make one, what would it say? Like just off the top of your head. Oh, yeah. That's a fun one. What would, what would it say? I just want to make sure my key's still here. Mine is live now because you guys all know that my word for this year is now. And so I want to live now. But I was going to do decide now. So I'm glad that I didn't. That would have been I'm glad that I changed year. my mind. That would have been awesome. <laughs> that would have been hot bananas. Um, let's see. Oh, Janine said, I was just going to say love your clothes. That color looks good on both of you. And Donna said love them. Thanks, Janine. Thank and you. Donna. Thank you very much. But no one's going to tell us what they want their... Shadow statement box, piece. their statement piece to say. I, I paused and thought of a good word. Yes. What they What they want their shadow yes. box to say. So again, one more quick time, you guys, you're going to need some blocks. Um, they can be vintage blocks. They can be regular alphabet blocks. Dollar spot blocks. Those are our dollar spot blocks, yes. Mm -hmm. And then you can get a shadow box or you can do any type of... Anything, really. They're, you oh, even or do even a flat... P, a flat or if you have a thicker frame that you mm -hmm. just took the, the glass and stuff out of, or here's an octagon box. Um, oh, Laura's would say that's dope. I love it. I love that very much. Yes. Um, Jake's would say awesome sauce. Well, maybe your sweet wife will make you one that says that just will, for your honey, office. Right for, right <laughs> in your office. Oh, okay. Janini said. Janini? Jan I'm sorry. <laughs> why is it that we struggle? Maybe we need to change our day. I, I know when it's an M, so that's how we do it, but we struggle. I struggle. I struggle all the time in the morning because, <laughs> actually, I struggle all the time. And time okay. out. People are going to go, you consider this morning? The struggle is real, people. <laughs> the struggle is real. Always in the life of Madge. Okay, I'm just saying it. Hey, and that's okay. It is. It's, it's hard. Yes. So Janine says... Live a creative life. I love that. I do too. I just, I didn't know how serious I wanted it. I just wasn't sure. Mm -hmm. So, like I said, we all know. I usually err on the side of not Midge serious. would have some smart ass comment. Usually. She, she, she simmered it down. <laughs> but she, she would have something like that. I should tell everyone, apparently I rubbed off, well, of course I got a lot of my attitude and stuff from my fascia. Yes, yes you did. But he took me to lunch the other day and we walk in and he has on a shirt that says, I hope your cell phone falls in the toilet. So I, if anyone wants to know, apparently where I get my love of sarcastic t-shirts from, that would be my dad. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Way to go, Stu. Way to go. Oh. Yes. Oh, Donna, Mitch couldn't decide. That is right. That the is. last minute I went with this. <laughs> yes, to decide is I'm trying decide. so hard. Oh, look at all the smiley lobbies. Oh. I love that. <laughs> Keep, bring them on. Bring them on, folks. Okay, so one more quick time. Mm -hmm. Blocks. Alphabet blocks of any size, shape, form, color, whatever. Yes. Some type of a shadow box or frame. frame. Would be awesome. Yes, ma'am. You are going to need some deco art paint. Mm -hmm. um, you are going to need some decoupage. Yes. From Beacon. Yes. You're going to need some power tack from Beacon. Yes. And also maybe some mixed media or three in one. Yes. Glue. That's always good for, to have on hand because you're going to need embellishments. Yes. Yes. 
and die cuts paper die cuts with, with the view paper mm -hmm. and if you want to some gesso yes gesso to mm -hmm. tame everything down a little bit yep and and a fun saying and a fun saying and you guys, really, I sit here and I keep looking at these cute blocks and I think <laughs> it would be such a fun kid craft. Like, in, I know it, for us, this was not a kid craft. It didn't right, turn into. Right, right. But it, I, I, in my mind, I close my eyes and I just see, like, my nieces and my little nephew on my kitchen table. Not on. Sitting at my kitchen table Around. with all blocks and making something like this. I think they would have a blast. Donna has this thing that she calls me now. It's flat squirrel. She sent me a little message about not being able to decide. Mm-hmm but I would be a flat squirrel. A flat squirrel. <laughs> so. Okay. I'm going to really work hard on my deciding. Yes. Yes, Laura Neiman. We got these at the dollar spot, the blocks and these. Was yes. it not even a week ago, yes. right? From Target. Probably so. like four days ago. $3 spot. Mm -hmm. Yes. So not very long ago. Hi, Christy. Christy just joined. Oh, hey, Hello, Christy. Christy. Um... What else was I going to say? Oh, yeah, don't forget the Velcro. If you want to make them interchangeable or you want it to be more of like a, a toy type of a thing, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. practice your spelling, whatever, get yep. your Velcro and yes. your felt. Yes. Coon and felt would probably be best. <laughs> yes, it would. Yes, it would. Yes. And, yeah, that's all you need. This is a really simple Hey, project. Chad, the male kindergarten teacher, this is an idea for you. <gasps> yes. Just saying. <laughs> she, she's just calling you out right now. <laughs> yes. And yes, the dollar spot always has cute stuff in my eyes. There's always something you can make from let me, the dollar let me, spot. Let me just oh, clarify shoot. this for one second. <laughs> the dollar spot and the dollar store for Midge is not a place where we could just run in and run out for five minutes. <laughs> she can't go into the dollar store and come out with less than 20, 20 items. Yes, I said that correctly. Two zero items. There's uh, always stuff there. She's speechless right now. And I even would Because I'm tired of defending myself. She gives me crap about this all the time. Because I love it. Because you know what? Let me tell you why though. I love it. Because if I ever need something, I she have it. has it. All so, right. So I give her crap, but you know what? I love her. It's all good. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I'll try to refrain the next. We actually have to go to the store today. We do. We do. So, we have some fabulous projects coming up, you guys. Yes. Um, we Like we said, we promised 2017 we would start out with a bang, and here we are. With a bang, boom, bop. Yep. <laughs> boom and bop. We love it so much. We leave to go to CHA on Thursday where we're we going to see so many of our fun, crafty friends. We can't wait. Yes. Super stoked. And then... Um, we're going to do a live show from CHA on Monday for, for sure. sure. Like at our regular time, we'll, we will be doing a show. Yes. Oh, what time do we demo on Monday? Hmm. 11 o'clock. Well, how perfect is that? That's awesome. So you know what we're doing? We're going to be going live from CHA while we are demoing. Oh, that's perfect because yes. we know what we'll be showing you, but we're not going to tell you yet. Right. <laughs> we're, that will be a super fun project. So that's why we are at the Beacon booth. Yes. Beacon. Be there yep. or be square. Yes. And we will also go live a few. I mean, we want to show everybody some stuff that we see and stuff we like and get your opinions on things and just show you what's out there. So we will be yes. going live, not just at our regular time, but other times throughout, throughout the trip. The day. So you'll want to make sure that you tune in for that. Mm -hmm. And then the next week, um, we have a fabulous, it's going to be, actually, it, it probably will be live because my sweet husband bought the internet package. <gasps> so live from whatever country we're in on Monday on to Monday's Monday, away. The 20-something. No. Uh -uh. 30th. The 30th. The 30th of January. I don't know where we are that day, but we're somewhere. We are. We're set and sell, and we will be, we will be, it won't be a huge, long mingle, but mm -hmm. it will be a fun mingle. And we may or may not have a little recorded thing to go with it. Yes. It will pop up as well. Yes. But something. Something is happening. And then, then you guys, it's Valentine's Day. Yes, so it is. look, look forward to some awesome Valentine projects. We have some really fun stuff that is in the works, and a couple things that are already done. But mm -hmm. we didn't want to give anything away yet. No, no. So, and if there's something you guys want us to do, or you have questions about, please make sure that you leave us a message or you email us at midgeandmadgemingle at gmail .com. Be sure to follow us on Instagram at midgeandmadgemingle. 
And we already knew that Lauren Eamon and I are alike on the same brain. You guys are. A lot. Yes. But she said, same girl. I love the dollar spot and the dollar store and the thrift stores. It's my special place. I love that so much. <laughs> it brings me calm. It does. It brings me <laughs> calm. That is what your shadow box should have said. It brings me calm. And then a little, the dollar spot. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So many yeses. Yes. So do any of you guys have any questions? <laughs> she said that if I had used Velcro, I could have rearranged these words to say, strut your gut. I could yes. have. Instead of strut your mutt, strut your gut. Well, <laughs> I don't want to strut my gut very often, but <laughs> I could have arranged these words to say that you are correct. <laughs> yes. All right. All right. So, do you have anything else um, that we need to I don't think so. Shout Just out or fun stuff coming up and yeah. always cruise the dollar spot for good finds. <laughs> oh, I will say this, though, real quick. If you have not checked out Mark Montano's awesome oh. ATC card swap, yes, it's not too late. You have till February 10th to join mm -hmm. in the awesome swap. So if you guys are curious about what that is, go to his Facebook page or you can go to his blog and he has all of the information there. The theme is love and you guys, it's going to be super fun. I know there's so many people that are joining in on this. I so. love getting some happy mail. And it's not hard to make five tags. Use a little deco art paint real quick and yeah. call it good. Yeah. So. so And yes, he did join in with deco art. So you guys, it's going to be a fun time. So check into that because we would love to get one of your ATC cards. Yes, we would. Okay, okay so is that all? Um, Chrissy said your cards are so good. Well, my word. Thanks. We love that. <laughs> no. Okay, are we okay. doing a really quick, like, our little freeze frame? And we are. We are doing our freeze oh, frame. Janine said who? It's Go to Mark Montano. Just look up. I will tag. How about this? I will, um, I will in just a minute, after we get off, I will uh, grab his link, and I will post that in the comments for you. So then that way you can pull him up. But it is Mark Montano, and it mm -hmm. is M-A-R-K. M O N T A N O. I just wanted to sit here because she always looks at me when she's spelling, but she was I doing to make so good sure. all by herself. Did I spell it right? I did, didn't I? Yes. It's like Montana, but Montano. Yes, there we go. There you go. Awesome. That's how you know for sure. Mm -hmm. And he has a new <laughs> book out, and it's called, I think it, I'm, I'm not even going to say it because I'll say it wrong, but it's something that it does have ass in there. Like his big, big ass, ass book of bling. bling. Uh -huh. My favorite. But he has a new one coming out, and I'm really excited about that one. So. And we might get to see him this week, too. Yes. He's always fun. Yes, he is always fun at the Deco Art booth. Mm-hmm. Okay, so is that it? We're wrapping up. we got to do a quick I ready. I think we are and ready and pause. So I we need to hold these up just a little bit. Okay. I love it so, so much. Holding. And I know you guys love to see us hold and smile. And perfect. Yes. And I love that we both do the... <sighs> what are we <you>? Yes. <laughs> and Mitch, Mitch always laughs because as I'm trying to take the freeze frame... It takes me like 7,500 times to get the snap, but we get it. Which I don't even really know why we care because regardless, no matter how hard I try, every time like when our video posts and when anybody <laughs> shares anything, it's always, I'm doing this ungodly, gross, like, me face. I'm not even doing one right now because I'm so afraid that that's where <laughs> someone's going to capture and post. What? But you know what I'm talking about, like a disgusted, like... There was really one that was awesome. She was looking at me with disgust. It was almost like a... And it was a freeze frame. And I was like, ooh, don't want to make Mitch mad. No, no, no. It's all good. Oh, see. Janine said that she found him. Oh, perfect. Okay. Donna said working from home. Oh, hi, Callie. Callie joined. Hi, Callie. Um, let's see. I'm looking really, really quick. Uh, Janine found him. Oh, that's right. Um, Laura Neiman, he's from her little hometown, her small hometown. Oh, my stars. Yep. And screen cap, she said. Yep. That was screen cap. Yes. Okay. Yes. So I'm going to say totally doodly, everybody. Yes. And we will be back with lots of live videos coming up. From Make sure you join us. Join us, join us. And always, please contact us if there's anything you want to see or have us yes. do or try or yada yada. Yes. And any of our past mingles, if you want to see them, go to midgeandmadgemingle.com and yes. click on our video site. And every single video is there. They've all also been uploaded to YouTube, so you can check that out too. And some of them are doozies. Doozies, she says. 
Hey, all right. I'm peacing out. You can She's peacing mic. out. I'm just going to sit here. Oh, I'm taking the mic. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, there. There we go. All right. Okay, you guys, we hope you have a fabulous week and an awesome day, and we'll see you at CHA. Bye.